Is that the one with the... Is that the unit unit? His other unit? Yeah, the, the one we bought in January. So it might be his. It might be his. If, if this is his unit, I am really, really good. We just got to Austin, Texas. You saw that we bought a unit two months ago? It's one of the last ones we what bought. Three? Check that video out. Yeah, oh, all right. This is gonna be a jackpot. It I was looking through units in the Austin area today, and this one just fit the profile of this same kind of boxes, stacked high, Look, I see action figures in those boxes, babe. Oh, you do? I think so. Same kind of little tag. These used to be expensive back in the day. You pulled this out and it fans out. You know what I mean? Tags, not at the same facility. I was telling Gina, I think this might be his unit. So if there's a bunch of stuff in this unit from Austin Auction Gallery, this guy was just buying stuff from the auctions and he was just storing it in the auctions. There was toys, there was antiques, expensive clocks. We just spent $5,000 we were driving in from Dallas, Texas. Looks like we might be right because his other storage facility was right here and we are one mile away. Let's find out. It'll have auction tags in here. If this is yeah. his unit, it'll be auction tags. All right, guys. So, so look, it might be very well his. She said it was a, this guy had a store, a business, yeah. and his partner embezzled money from him or something. That's how he lost it. So, anyway, hey, here we go. So, another thing is, she said that another bidder. This is weird, bidders, and I know who you are. They called. She said yes. The people who are bidding against you called and asked, uh, wanted the name of the person that they that won it. And look, you need to stop that. Don't be doing that. Don't be asking them ladies to do illegal stuff. I know who you are. Look, play nice. You had you had the opportunity to bid more. When I lose a unit, I don't go whine about it. I just go bid on another unit. Stop calling around. That's creepy. Let's go see what we got. Well, see the tags? Yeah. The tags hanging on stuff? This guy down there, he had tags from auction companies. And you put clocks. He had old clocks like this. Wow. And he had random stacked art. But it was literally just right up the road. Really? And this looks at the Cube Smart on the corner. Oh, I couldn't even tell what that was. This is his unit bag because he had toys. That big yeah. box like that. The other unit, he had those Lots same of kind of boxes, uh, Home Depot stacked yeah. to the ceiling in one area just like this. So wow. I was like, this might be his unit. Well, hopefully the dry rot won't be too bad on the cowhide. Oh, it's, it's his good. unit. It is? Look. The original in the box. Yeah. Oh, he had one in that other He unit. had other toys for him. A few moments later. All right, guys. So, hey, looks like I was right. So $5,000. Go back and watch the other video. This is Austin Auction Gallery. So I bought this guy's unit, different place. I and mean, he had the same Toy Story stuff, Pokemon cards. I'm really curious what this is right here. I know. This has really got my interest. Yeah, look at this. This is a world clock thing. World time. Oh, this is that's cool. sick. So I saw this was a scale and I could see a tag on it backwards. Couldn't see the tag. If I just saw Austin Auction Gallery, I would have for sure. The description said clocks. Remember the last video, the first thing we saw was clocks. And look at here. Yep. He had very obscure art. He definitely had Toy Story toys. You couldn't tell what this was because it was blurry. But that looks like a um, Sin City toy. That's definitely an older little cash register or a, a fun little uh, hoo ha. Oh, what is that? There's some bad stuff. That looks like a huge cash register. So I'm going to guess. We had sports memorabilia in the last one, so I'm gonna guess some of those back uh, things that we're gonna have probably toys 
Uh, we found coins in the last one. So we anyway, did. hey guys, let us clear the space. We'll start loading because we got to get back to the house. All right, hey y'all, look at this. Check this out real quick before we pack this up. So this is one of the reasons why I bid on it. The pictures were a little blurry, so you couldn't tell if it was broke or not. But this thing is in phenomenal shape. Look, it's got the little windows where the cannons come out. And so, all right, he's going to load that up. We got paintings, and we're going to start unboxing. Well, oh look, do you remember that? Oh, is watches. this the one where I found yeah. the tag watch? You found the tag watch I in this unit. I found the tag watch in this unit. In this guy's mm -hmm. unit. The last one. Just like this random A freaking, that says Ann Klein, but do you remember this? I do, there's look, a lot of watches in Random there. watches in this one too. And I, I, I taught y'all in that unit, I was like, hey, y'all can't just assume, look at this. What kind is that? A Yao's old something, very nice, little leather watch. Uh, but I told y'all, you, oh look, Pokemon in the bottom. Ooh. All right, we're gonna have to go through this uh, very carefully. So we're gonna set this aside and we'll get a transfer token. All right, let's just move some. Okay, these are ones we'll have to go through. And look at this, babe. That might be silver. Oh, that's really pretty. Yeah, this might be silver. You know, he did, he also had He did, that, he had silver jewelry. I think, that's, jewelry I think that actually might be silver because it's very light. Old books. Old, old stuff. Smokes for all ages, aces. The Smoker's Garland. Look, this is a pipe book from like the 30s. That's pretty sweet. Go ahead and give this to him. This is a, oh, look at, babe, I'm telling you. Hey, y'all, go stuff, follow our high bid right now. We are offering um, pickup for the next two auctions. We're going to test it out, see how it goes. So, listen, all this big stuff, y'all are going to be, oh, this is a wine corker, babe. Oh, that is it? Yeah, I bet you like crazy. that. Look. Uh, look, see? Yeah, this is what you you want I that? I don't need that. You sure? <laughs> you go through like three or four bottles a day. I do not. All right. What is that? Um, it's it's probably oh this is an umbrella stand, so there would be things that fit down in there, and you would stick your umbrellas and stuff and put this at the front door. All right, guys, if the world wasn't full of enough bad advice, you can uh, buy a Dr. Laura doll and get some more. Look at this. That's probably a uh, gold leaf. Very pr pretty crystal perfume thing. That's like, that could be 40, 50 bucks. You know what I mean? Is that a Kardashian? Who is that? You think she's famous? Is she a dancer? Look at all of these boxes. So yeah, so some the people who were bidding against me, like I said, called up here and asked. Oh, I told her I wouldn't say. But they shouldn't be calling up here and asking who won the unit. So I figured out why. Because I've done this before, you're bidding on two units at one place and it's out of town. So they won the 10 by 20 that's full of just the bulky furniture. They won it for 10 bucks and because that one drug out so long, that's why they kept bidding and bidding on it. And then she was like, oh, they were probably like, oh, it's not worth the money. And they probably backed off. But anyway, y'all, look at this painting, babe. This, that's this unbelievable. Look, oh, wait, that's hold on. It's got painful. info on the back. Um, unit case something frame y'all this is an oil it's an oil painting whoa that is that's pretty amazing that is we're gonna have to look this up because this is a big old fancy schmancy painting all right should we give him this yeah that's pretty cool uh didn't turn it's a little bit older it's got a little nick oh look it's got a nick on the bottom silver eagle though somebody will still want that you know what I mean? So it's got mm -hmm. a little little nick on the bottom, but it doesn't look too bad, so we'll sell that. You really couldn't tell this is what this was. It looked like packs of batteries. Oh, he's in there too. Sin City. Is that, uh, what's it? Oh, no, that, oh. This is the Bruce Willis doll. Really? Bruce Willis is in bad condition right now. Yeah. Yeah, this is, I think this is the Bruce Willis doll. Yeah, this is Bruce Willis. That's pretty sweet. What is this? Oh, is it a humidor? Humidor? Humidor. Oh, that's Ooh. nice. Oh, it is nice. That is what it is. Look. Thompson. Cherry yeah, wood. It smells nice. really good in there. There you go. Yeah, look. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to pick all the sellable stuff out. Um, stuff like this obviously will sell by itself. Uh, Polaroid. Spider-Man. Credit card. Oh, that's cast iron. Um, it's still gonna be some kind of mold or something, maybe. All right, we'll throw all that away. All right, look at all these cowboy hats. Yeah, those look like they're really nice. Stetson. Yeah, Stetson. So these are Stetson. There's more back here. 
These are straw hats. So let's put all these in here. Uh, there's a couple guitars and stuff down here too. So let's go ahead and pack these up. Look at this. More bronze statues. This is actually really neat, nice. It's a Lord of the Rings. Looks like maybe the first one, but they had a $125 price tag on that. So that's like something that's gonna have to be kept. What is this? Compact edition offer English dictionary. It's got a little drawer in it. Oh, that's interesting. What that's do you put in the drawer of a dictionary? I don't dictionary? know, but I feel like we should. Pack. I don't know. What do you put in the drawer of a dictionary? <laughs> oh, is that a bookend or a statue? We're gonna call it a statue if we only find one. That's uh, no, that's resin. Abe Lincoln. Remember, he had a lot of books last time. A lot of books. Oh, they he were did pretty have good. a lot of good books. The Gourmet Cookbook Volume Two of Two. This is a set. I bet you this goes for some money. Oh I yeah. I bet you it does. We're gonna keep this. Ooh, that's cool. It's a huge crystal elephant. What is this? Okay, we don't keep stuff like that. Oh, that might oh. be Sterling. That's pretty. <laughs> this is a nice crocodile dummy. Y'all, look at that. Rambo. All right. Bubble wrap. Oh, yeah, nice. PlayStation 3. Oh, oh wow. PlayStation 4. Paragon from Victoria Rose, England. All right, look at these. Looks like maybe a scrap stuff. I'll let you go through these. But this is what he was keeping. Jewelry end. There's a knife in this one. I like knives. Oh, that's a nice little older silver knife. Anyway, we'll combine that all down. He didn't take any of these boxes. No, he didn't. Here, let's, uh, well. Here, hold on. Up to Chris. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. We found that exact no, thing in the other this. unit. No, look at this. This has got a different style on it. Oh, it does. It's kind of wood style. Woo! Here you go, Chris. Very on. dusty. Pretty. Really pretty. Uh, all right, let's show them down in here. A lot of randomness. Oh, that's really, what is that? Look at that. It's got like a, oh, you hang them. These are older. These are cast iron monkeys. <laughs> oh, look, that's a toothpick holder. That's an old uh, iron to toothpick holder. Old gauge. It's an old bronze monkey. Ooh, I'm gonna do a, what is this? Ooh, oh, that's, oh, this is an iron lamp. Oh, that's cool. That'll sell. Yeah. This is an old ice bucket. All right, guys, so look, uh, Gina's working, so I'm going to, who is that? Nolan Ryan. Nolan Ryan, a little a statue. Y'all, look, oh, look. Well, first, we found this. It's a Texas Ranger, team side and bat, okay? Then, we just found this ukulele, okay, and it's autographed. If you want to tell me down in the comments who you think that is. Uh, but we got a autographed ukulele. We found some guitars down there. We're kind of cleaning this section up because my sister uh, lives close by out here. Oh, he had, did he have good t-shirts last time? Uh, we'll just combine that into a trash bag. But so my sister's going to come out here and we're going to give her all this stuff for free. Because uh, last time she, we gave her this guy's unit, she made some good money. All right, guys, look at this box right here. It has all these Harley Davidson t-shirts. They're kid sizes, but look, they all have tags on them. Look at this killer Harley Davidson t-shirt. Oh, this oh no youth. All Harley youth t-shirts, but we got several. We got sweatshirts. Look at all this. This whole stack of Harley Davidson clothes all has tags. Look, $30, $40. So we'll keep all of the Harley stuff. I'm not gonna keep Joe Boxer stuff. That's gotta be a few hundred bucks just right there in Harley stuff. Easy. Yeah, this would have been what they used to scoop stuff and weigh it. Um, just set those aside, babe. I'll look at them. Okay. Uh, oh, do you know what these are? These are decanters. Should be decanters. And these are actually the popular ones. Because Jim Beam decanters, you know, people think they're worth more than they are. But the, 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 pol the political ones, and we have the elephant. So we have the matching Democrat jackasses and the uh, Republicans. I, I'm, I'm neither one. And so, just in case you were curious, that's alabaster. That bubble wrap. Look, that's alabaster. All right. Oh, look. Oh, Hummel. Oh, we got it. Oh, man. We. Oh, that's old Hummel. Yo. All right. We got to wrap him. That's old Hummel. That's not the repop Hummel. Ah, it's a brass seal. Let's see what else we got down in here first. We might trash all this. Uh, oh, compote. It's already chipped. Uh, oh, this is heavy. 
that's just weird. Like, why do we want little naked kids in a choir? Like, who came up? Hey, hey, we got to make new product for the store. I got it. Naked kids singing. I don't know. Got me. Oh, look, babe, another one. What? It's the um, winky screwdriver to have, open your your thing. So we have. Hey. Ding, ding, ding. I don't want to lose this. But I do want to check and see if this is ivory, because that looks like it could be ivory. Doesn't look like it. We'll keep that as a pilgrim. All right, this looks like it's all going to be trash. Oh. Oh, neat. Sweet. Really, this is from the 60s. You know what this is? No. Okay. This is what you would carry your cigarettes around if you were rich. It's a cigarette case and a lighter. All in oh, one. Oh, that's pretty cool. But only if you're rich. All right, we do have some condition issues on the chair. This is rusty. Oh, great. Is this what's in here? I'll just leave this for Lindsay. It's a, a food processor. Oh, a pasta and beyond, huh? All right, we decided to keep this too, but it's look at this, y'all. A 1906, turn the light just a little bit. 1906, uh, public and grammar school certificate. Wow. Look at that. Auto bridge. That's just, that's a cool old item. You know what I mean? Uh, so we'll have to go through this. I'll give this to Gina because look, we got old, ooh, old per, uh, pearl purses. Remember, this is that guy's unit we found a thousand dollar watch just chilling in the trash can. That's really pretty, hand done, super heavy and beautiful. So, ooh, wow. Mr. Charles Brennister, comedian. What? Is there? Look at the look at the oldness of that. Look at this. This is sweet. M. Young. Yo, these look like, are those signatures? Robinson, oh, that's Mrs. Robinson. She's a dirty thing, you know what I'm talking about? They wrote a lot of songs about that lady. Look at that. Or is that Miss Parker? No, it's Miss Robinson. Oh, it's Miss Robinson. Parker. Mr. Digimon. This is sweet, y'all. These are really neat. And then down in here, got a bunch of randomness. Gotta check it. Look at that, it's Picasso. First box was super light. Uh, who is that? This is gonna be Star Wars Episode One. Not the best stuff. Oh, is this Stranger Things? Yep, Eleven Stranger Things. Uh, Funko Pop. We'll try to keep the. Oh, this is so good. Look at that. That's old. Oh, look at Share a Smile, Becky. What? All right, it's sealed in the box, and then down here. Who's that? Corey Feldman. Oh, Steve. Who's this big? Oh, Pokemon toys. Sweet. Okay. Oh, look, more Funkos. Super Monster. Oh, what's this old light? Night light. Star Wars. And then we got, looks like, more of the rain. I don't know who that chick is. And then I think that's the other kid. Uh, oh, no, it's Ghostbusters. Lucas. All right, so, cool deal. Batman 688. Oh, this is... Oh, there's a coin collecting book because there's quarters in it. Oh, there might be. Oh, there is. Quarter collection. See, that's why you got to go through the paper, yo. And these are all books we're leaving here. Look, look at all these comic books. Richie Rich. It might be the full run, y'all. Probably is. Is that all Richie Rich? It is. Look. Look at all these Richie Rich comics. We'll put those in the tub. Fat stack. And then look. Hold another fat stack of comics in here. Look at that bad boy. Is that can't all be Richie Rich, is it? Is that all? Oh no, it's not. Oh yeah, it is Richie Rich. That's sweet though. That's a lot of comics. Oh, what is it? Y'all, oh, y'all check this out. I found sealed Pokemon cards. Sealed pack of Pokemon cards. Oh, this is Ninja Turtle something. Sealed. Oh look, this is an old Disney record. Mickey Mouse Brave Little Taylor, I remember that. Mark Shaganinal. We'll leave that here because it already went through half price books once. Oh look, we got more comics. Richie Rich. Uh oh look, we got Carl Rove. Always check your political books because the first two or three pages might be signed. Oh look, to Glenda and Glenn. Oh look, it is signed Carl Rove. <laughs> yeah, oh, told y'all. Oh look, Oliver North, let's see if he signed. Oh yeah, look. I'm glad I just checked these. Oliver signed too. General signed. Oh, yeah. um, oh, Rick Perry. 
Yeah, Rick Perry signed. Political book collection. Oh, look, Bill Bradley. I don't know who he is, but let's see. Oh, oh, Bill didn't sign it. Bill, you wasn't important enough. Oh, wait, Bill signed it. Oh, Bill, you made it. You made it. Well, your book sold for five bucks, Bill, so I don't know if I necessarily said you made it. World Atlas. Oh, let's keep the World Atlas. What year is this? Is it before they did the uh, Antarctic Treaty? And if y'all want to think about it, we all act like we're free, but the Antarctic Treaty says that all of us free people and all the Earth and all the globe, we can't go past a certain point. So we are kind of limited and trapped to a certain thing that the government says we can't go see. Doesn't that make y'all very curious? It makes me curious. All right, y'all, check this out. I'm already running out of battery. I got to show you this. So we just found probably already, probably about 10 or 15 signed books. But so you know how I tell you to check them. Look, Dick and Liz Cheney, both signed. Take that, bub. Uh, I'm keeping this. I like reading this old American books to see um, how much stuff NASA changed. Um, look at this, y'all. Ronald Reagan. It's got a signature, baby. We got Dick Cheney. We got all these. Paul Ryan signed his. Uh, go for it. Magic. Pat Williams. Pat Williams. Signed by Pat Williams. Jumpstart your energy. I don't know if anybody wants your book. She signed it. Weight Watchers Energy. I just don't know, Sarah. Are you that popular? I don't know who you are. Okay, let's see. Oh, is that Calvin? Oh, it's Calvin and Hobbes. What? What's that say? VJ. Bruce Spitzer. Records on VJ. Okay, well, let's get... This is not the best filming job I've ever done. Let's get... I think we probably... Those are not signed, but we definitely want the Calvin and Hobbes. For sure, Calvin Hobbs is killer. I love Calvin Hobbs. Actually, I might keep that. Uh, and then let's see. Let's check these little small ones on the side. But y'all, that's what I'm talking about. You got it. Oh, look at this. To Bob, thanks for your support. Uh, University of Texas. I guess that's the coach that signed that. That's pretty. Uh, no, it's Fred. 1982. I was two years old, bro, when that came out. All right, y'all, check this out. So, all right, we've got. All of this done. There's still some stuff in there. I'm leaving the cow chair because the, the rivets are rusty. I'm going to leave that for my sister. Uh, she can probably clean that up, make a few hundred on it easy. Uh, we're just, this is a good unit, isn't it? I know, it is Super good unit. Y'all check this out. This is all brand new Harley Davidson stuff. Look, glasses. How much were these? Do they have price tags? Did I say Italy? Yeah, look, Italy. Look at that. Harley Davidson glasses, glasses glasses uh look harley davidson pins uh look more glasses uh headphones mugs all kinds of swag oh what's in here oh just a uh, harley oh that's kind of cool harley davidson look more glasses oh we're gonna find watches and stuff in here too all right we're not taking all of this stuff out but look at all of this y'all swag all the way to the bottom i mean listen there's got to be over a g yeah, and Harley, Harley Davidson, Davidson stuff, easy. Look at the size of this box. Real quick, let's show them that coin box. Where's that coin box? Oh, it's right here. Oh, I'll show them these too. Y'all look at these. I didn't even look in them. I peeked. Cause, just because I know what these are. These are coin books. Always check your... I'm telling you, these were in with the books. So, 1909 VDB is the ones you really want. See how this one's only got a half a million right there, the S? has a half a million uh it only made a half a million of those so uh there's probably some good rare ones in there these were silver i don't know how many were in there i think yeah look little yeah, cool. little, little dimes mm -hmm. 1900 1901 1903 oh look we got more over here so we'll sell that as a lot oh i did we didn't even dig down in this <laughs> are these even is there oh, how do you know? I don't know well where's the other ones didn't i hand you a stack of them of coins yeah they're in something i think I thought so. Maybe not. Okay. I thought, y'all, we have a box somewhere with those on it. Y'all, check this out. Hey, babe, check this out. I found a box of these. Keep this in the truck. There's the coins right here underneath oh. this, okay? Okay. Look at this. Look at these. What? Oh, Olight wants me to do a thing, and they told me to pick out some products. They have some sweet new stuff, so might be doing that. Where was that? Look at this, y'all. Oh, that one didn't oh, work. it didn't work. Hold on. We got more? Oh, yeah, look. Oh, mine worked. Look at this, y'all. 
I don't have to use that. Sorry, y'all. Sorry. Audio probably changed again, but, uh, oh, look. That, oh, I thought it Pokemon. Uh, we had to change phones again because the battery's dying. So we're just going to pull this whole box out because, look, phones. Uh, but, oh, there's that's Bevo. Texas Longhorns. What are these watches? Soki. Oh, look, coins. Coin wrappers. Yeah, we're going to have to. Hold on. Let's get this clothes out. Who's missed me? Were these crop skinny crap? Is that what that says? Skinny crap. Rebel. I think those were called Rebel. All right, guys, check these out. Gina's got Colt McCoy. It's cracked. Uh, and that's Ricky Williams, the guy that uh, quit millions uh, to smoke weed. Uh, they should have never made him stop for the NFL. It's not like it's an enhancing <laughs> drug. If anything, the other team should have wanted him to smoke more weed. Uh, so anyway, two autographs. Oh, let's look through this. Oh, is this going to be... Oh, look, more new Harley Lord. Davidson stuff. So, oh, look. Oh, look. Do you need any new uh, undies? I got that dollar thong action. If y'all uh, are needing it, you know, hit me up. All right, y'all. Another tub. Not keeping that. I don't like the frame on it. I do like this whole phone. Uh, um, it's, it's still a dial-up phone. But, oh, there's a Pokemon tub. Or 10. Definitely keep the phone, for sure, I like that. Uh, this is a little brass set the Empire State Building. Y'all look, I found copper tubing. Um, what is this? Oh, look at that. A nice, is that a case knife? Oh, I found a case knife too. Yeah, oh, this is an old timer. Old timers are good, good. That's a good 30, 40 dollars, not easy. Uh, all right, let's keep going through here. Nice and slow, what kind of belts is that? All right, a Modern Chronicle. Oh, National Geographic. Oh, look a little, oh, that's so cute. Let's make sure this doesn't break. This old German cuckoo oh, clock, a mini one. And it's got both the people in there where they're gonna run around. The boy's chasing the girl. Okay. All right, what is this? Is this a Kiwi Shoe Shine? Oh yeah, a little Kiwi Shoe Shine and kit. Tend to a Pokemon thing. That's a Harley Davidson LED flashlight. Michael Bolton tape. Whoa, now we're hitting the big bucks, guys. Hit, oh, look at this. Oh, that's really cool. Look at this, this clock. That's pretty sweet, it's a big Morgan. That's pretty cool, look, Harley Davidson clock. Oh, or cool. I mean, cards. Mm -hmm. Little Hulk. Oh, that's a, is that a compass? Oh, look, HBO compass. Oh, Band of Brothers, that's a compass. That's that TV show. Oh, here's some weights to a cuckoo clock. Um, Y'all, you got to look through this stuff good because there's going to be little $20, $30 items just sitting in here. That went to a cuckoo clock for sure. Uh, what is that? I'm going to hold on to that for a minute. Look at all these. Oh, look at those little best little sinkers. Oh, those are little fish sinkers. Those are cute. Okay, those go to... Uh, again, a cuckoo clock. That don't want the all right. Kids books, guys. Look, some older Cat in the Hat. But look down under here is all the ho old Hardy Boys set. Oh, that's gonna sell. Yeah, that'll sell real good. Probably a few hundred for that whole set. Mm -hmm. Found the book. Oh, that's actually a good newer one. Both of these are pretty decent cards. Oh, and the Blastoid. There's doubles in these, too. We'll check these. These are newer, but those are definitely some of the newer ones you want. Uh, this is all... Well, that's some older stuff. It's a little... It's mixed older and newer. But look, there's holograms. Yeah, this is sick. Oh, here's some older stuff. Oh, uh, yeah. Definitely a mix. Looks like this was actually a kid's collection. So that's good because that's when you can find the good cards. Let's see. Oh, I'm just sitting here recording, aren't I? Yeah, I'm pretty pumped okay. about this. All right, I'll go through these in the car on the way home. Ivysaur. See if there's shadow list. There's definitely doubles. You can tell like there's a bunch of cards in there. So we'll take these out. Double check them. Check for any rare ones. But hey. Oh, look, the sports action. All right.